Marie-Sophie Rohweder is an 18-year-old high school student in Berlin. Right now, she's preparing for her final exams. After that, she'd like to take a year off and do social work, preferably in India. She's interested in natural science and in helping the community. And there's one issue that she's particularly passionate about. Climate protection is really important for all of us. I'd like to see more emphasis on it in the public sphere and in schools. During the summer break, she attended a seminar on climate change. Since then, she's been reading up more, even information in English. The seminar was attended by students from all over Germany. Many are now keen to take action, particularly here in Germany, where the effects of climate change are not yet so obvious. It's something that's especially relevant for us younger people, because we'll still be around in 2050. Right now, it's the small island states that are immediately threatened. Here, it's not so immediate. But we're the ones who caused it. That's the worst of it. So we should definitely take action. Together with other students from the summer seminar, Marie Rohweder set up her own climate project. The group put together a presentation, which they now want to give at their various schools. At the John Lennon School in Berlin, which Marie Rohweder attends, staff are already aware of the need to teach students about this important issue. This year, for example, we're having a half-week project for the 12th graders. Three days which we've entitled Save the World, where we're mainly focusing on climate change and the political response, where we draw up our own game plan for Copenhagen. Marie feels it's a good start, but not enough. She wants there to be greater awareness across the board. It isn't enough to only teach about climate change in geography or not to teach it at all. We need it in biology, physics, chemistry and especially in politics. Only then can you get an overview and form your own opinion. So Marie Rohweder has her hands full. At school she's preparing for her university entrance exams. And soon she'll be off to Copenhagen herself for the climate conference. She wants to join the protesters there, and that's not all. I've never been to Copenhagen. It's exciting. As well as the demos and the side events, I hope there will also be time to see the city. For Rohweder, combating climate change will take more than just school debates and presentations. Everyone can take action themselves. So what is Marie doing to help the environment? First, I don't eat any meat. I'm a vegetarian. I've installed a special device on my TV so that it doesn't use electricity all day. And I avoid taking domestic flights. I use the train a lot. And she won't be flying to Denmark either. She's chosen to travel by bus instead.